myself into. You are Danny and Shirley Carpenter. I am Tanya. She's Tanya. Why? We're the Carpenters. You are expected. But Madame Heels does not receive visitors until the hour of midnight is upon us. The Dracula bit again. We will attempt to make your stay comfortable for the next two days. We're very anxious to meet Madame Heels. Most are. But not until the hour of midnight. You will be called. It's 2.30 in the afternoon. What in the hell are we supposed to do in the meantime? A room has been assigned you. Come. I trust you will make yourselves at home. We came here for that purpose. But we can't make it at home. Yeah. Madame Heels feels her guests must be pleased. You will have these to service you. All you must do is squeeze this little dong for attention. Thank you. Until midnight. That's weird. I don't like this whole setup. I admit it's a strange place, but strange happenings come from strange happenings. But what's going to happen if they find out we're not really married? They won't if you don't tell them. And besides, we won't be if you don't find out what it's all about and what it takes to make a woman happy in her sex life. I never heard any complaints before you came along, you mother. Did you say something? Oh, shut up. Feels inviting. You wouldn't know what to do with a bed if you did try it out. I sure wish you'd stop trying to insult my manhood. Manhood? Ha! 
That's what we came here for. To get you a manhood. A witch. Bullshit. Madam Heels is not a witch. She's a necromancer. That still spells witch to me. W-I-T-C-H, witch. Tanya? Yes, Carl? Isn't it time? Carl, I do believe you have become insatiable. Only because you taught me to be that way. I suppose I have. But there are others in the house now. Another to be serviced. But I want to be first. I must come first. I pay plenty to be first. To be completely cured. Very well. You are a quickie artist. I suppose I can spare the time. But Madame Heels will have to speak to you about further servicing. That'll come later. Now is the time. Must be now. Come. <gasps> oh. You nearly made me wet my nightgown, old boy. It's new, too. Oh. He died of rabies, you know. Oh. I'm Barb. I'm one of the inmates. Inmates? Yes, like, you're in, you can't get out. I must say, you're a good-looking one. Your wife was much more demonstrative when she saw the wolf mummy. Yeah. I've wanted you. But what about my wife? You mean you're Shirley. Oh, yeah. I, uh... Forgot she was your lover, not your wife. Something like that. You'd never forget me. This could prove to be very interesting. I'm sure it will be. Yeah. 
It is time. Bring me the patience. For such a fancy setting, you think these are conventional enough? The word conventional has many connotations. Never more so than in this establishment. Come here, I want to show you something. Not all react to the treatment successfully. There are those who will never find satisfaction in their, their universal language. Sex. Some want too much, others too little. I didn't react very well, did I? There is always the future. Like them and their future? Not like them. They can never return to a world which will reject them. They are happy here. Come, we mustn't keep the madam waiting any longer. Where have you been? I could ask you the same question. Well, I had a delightful time. Yes, but did she? Problems again? I might have problems, but it looks like these people got a hell of a lot more problems than me. Nobody's got more problems than you, and that's the truth. your appearance, oh, Madam Heels. they worked out. She has been a tremendous student. She has learned to sex well. Then she shall be removed. You've graduated. Hey, what about me? We still have some work to do on you. Don't put me in there. No, I'll free. No, uh, not with her. Quit it. Quit it. 